good morning or afternoon or evening or night depending on when I actually get this video out there it's Ona and Giblets for your energy customer service reps from Chicago and today is Wednesday November 30th 2022 it's the last day of November and we're going to do this video if we can pull it together and close out November for 2022 Today we have a Pisces moon, today and tomorrow. Um, it will make a conjunction to Neptune tomorrow. But today I think is a good prep for it. The numerology of the day is a 4711. So if you add 11, 30, and 2022, 20, it's reduced down to 4711, which is a master number and it corresponds to the Seven of Cups in the Tarot. So here's our Pisces moon, right? All these choices. Some of them are realistic and some of them are not. That card in the Tarot has the reputation of delusions, illusions, uh, the cups are filled with the seven deadly sins. So pick your, you know, pick your sin kind of thing. I think on the lighter side is and what the message of the day and even the month of November has to sort of sum up or conclude is watch your input, okay? Watch what you're putting in yourself physically. Watch what you are allowing yourself to see on social media. Uh, so mental input spiritual input, what do you believe, what's changing about your beliefs. So that's how we're gonna burn up November, all right? And I've got probably um, a bunch of days in a row where I have, where I do a burn. Uh, usually always right after work when I get home, but lately it's been, uh, I'm more consistent with it every morning and today I think is a really good day to because the Sun is in Sag okay Mercury's in Sag um, Venus is in Sag Mercury's making an opposition to Mars so a good burn okay would be a, a way to sort of close out anything that no longer serves you in this shift, okay? And prepare yourself for the next level, which is December, <laughs> tomorrow, okay? We're moving into December. And I think it'd be good to sort of start it really fresh, even though the moon will still be in Pisces and there's some clearing to do. Incense. Uh, herbs. We even talked about this last night in astrology class. It is that time of um, purification and disinfection. Okay, I have to say this is the art doll that uh, in the last video I showed you how I was going to start to put this together using isopropyl alcohol to soften the leather and then wrinkling it and then applying it. Since Monday, I can't use that alcohol. It's too many, It's it, the fumes are too much. I can still smell it, even though I stopped two days ago, opening the windows and all that. So I'm gonna take this as the message of purification. That's what alcohol does. It alters the substrate, okay? So on a Seven of Cups day, watch your input with anything that would alter your substrate, okay? Um, and find a different way to accomplish a better result, all right? So I did, I, I use like glue and then I spread it onto the piece so that I don't have to deal with that and try to exhaust that whole thing out of my house. But I think it sticks with me because it has that idea of disinfecting, 
okay, just kind of getting rid of, stepping into a place where you can walk away from toxicity and starting that whole thing moving. Let's pull a card and see what we've got going. So Seven of Cups is the energetic frequency mathematically, okay? And this fell out, King of Pentacles. That's probably Giblet's just wanting a little more snack crackers, okay? And the bottom of the deck is the Hanged Man, which is suspension. Um, Moon in Pisces, right? The uh, Neptune ruled sign. So whatever you put forth today, okay, do a little fire. I know it's a pentacle, but he's holding a match or something. And allow that to kind of simmer, right? Neptune is halfway, so kind of making a T-square with this Mercury sun venus energy and another square to mars on the other side so we've got a lot of neptunian energy going on all right tomorrow when the moon makes a conjunction to neptune it'll be that sort of energy that's the bottom of the deck and everything in between i'm sure will happen today right all right do a good burn, all right? I say that all the time, but I think today is an important day for that. And we will try and see you tomorrow and be more consistent, but I've been sort of obsessed with this project because, like I said, I never really write anything down. So as I'm putting it together, that's how I appreciate the flow of what's going on. And the top half is gonna be completely different, so we'll see. I'm sure it'll be totally different than what you're looking at right now. It always changes. I love you guys. Love you guys so much. Thank you so much. Thank you for being patient. Thank you for the comments. And we will see you hopefully tomorrow. If not, whenever Giblet says it's okay. Right, buddy? You want more pentacles, don't you? All right. Love you, love you, and thank you.